Deuce 28-25, the Saints have now lost three in a row, got a long flight home. And, um, you know, if you just tuned into this game there towards the end, the final two or three minutes of the game, you said, oh, man, what a great game, and it's a shame that the Saints had to lose that way. And it is a shame. But when you commit, you continue to go over uh, 10 penalties, or you have 10 penalties for 101 yards, and you continue to shoot yourself on the foot, when is that going to stop? Good question. I wish I could answer that for you. <laughs> I don't know the answer to that. I mean, but we can talk about what they did. I don't. I don't know when it's going to stop. I mean, but that it it has to stop. Special teams, you you're leaky, man. I mean, they 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 hit you on a fourth down play. They hit you on a couple returns. You're you're you're, you're bad. I mean, defensively, you gave up at least three first downs on third down alone. A couple of them were third and plus ten. You know, plus plus eight situations. They scored on a third and goal that was about the fifteen yard line. And it was a screen, you know, and just, I mean, there, there, there's, there's so many things that you can clean up to, to at least give yourself a chance. And so you're just not doing it. You had another um, fumble on a return. The defense played well enough, even though they hurt themselves to the standard that, you know, they've been held to. They hurt themselves. But the defense, they did enough good things out there to keep you in this game. It's the other parts of this group uh, that's got to, hey, you you, you, you got to pick it up. You, you, you can't turn the football over. The second half, the fourth quarter, you started to see kind of a team in certain spots what you were expecting to see, particularly running the football, being able to hit some throws, some different things like that. The quarterback had a fumble right there before two minutes. That's three points you gifted him. You, you, your defense was able to keep him out of the end zone on the punt, you know, so that's another three points that you gift him. It's just it's, it's, it's the touchdown. That should have been a field goal attempt at best, but you don't tackle. That's seven points that you gift them. I mean, and so it's just it's so many things that, man, they can clean up and just just stop doing it. If you're a, if you were a leader on this team, if you were in that locker room, what would you be telling your teammates? That those exact words. That's what it is. First, I'm gonna check myself. I, I, I'm gonna check myself first of all, and then it's it's those players policing the players. It's not Dennis Allen. It's, it, it, I'm, Dennis Allen ain't going to go out there and make a tackle. That's not his job. You get on your leaders. That's, that's their job. And it starts with them, policing themselves. How can I play better? What can I do? That, that, that's who it's on. Do six fumbles lost this season for the Saints. They had five of all last year. Six fumbles and four, lost fumbles in four games. Says a lot. Well, the numbers speak for themselves. I mean, it, it, it speaks for themselves as far as what what's going on. And the problem is, it's not just one person. It's it's a it's a multitude of guys that 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 are involved in that situation. And so that's why, even as a leader, before I can go tell you, hey, look, you need to play better. I need to look at myself. I, I need to play better. You know, it's just not on you. I need to play better. I need to lead better. I need to make sure that we're doing all of the little things that have been hurting us. So now when a moment comes, it's not the little things that's getting us beat. Deuce, the Saints had the ball uh, with two minutes and 43 seconds left at the Minnesota 43-yard line, first and 10. And Ingram for one yard, two deep passes that were incomplete, and that led to Will Lutz's 60-yard field goal. But the thing is, it only took 47 seconds off the clock. Is that a spot you look at and like to see another run on second down perhaps? Uh, I mean, they still had they had timeouts, so it wasn't like Minnesota wasn't going to use their timeouts in that situation. I mean, they, they, they understand it as well. And some of those passes, you probably um, – I can't remember exactly the, 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 the sequence that you're, you're referencing. But, I mean, in that, in that certain situation, I know that, um, yes, you want the clock to maybe run down and, and you kind of don't give them an opportunity. But at the end of the day, you feel like that, hey, look, I'm going to at worst score a field goal – but, you know, potentially be able to run time off and score a touchdown. Do so at one point in this game, the Saints turn the ball over in two out of three possessions. They're minus seven for the season, minus one for the game. There's another reason why you're on a three-game losing skid. I mean, the numbers speak for themselves in that situation. I mean, it's, it, 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 this isn't hard. <laughs> this, this, this isn't hard to figure out. I mean, there's there, there, there's three or four columns that you can kind of circle, and it'll point to you and say, "Yep, that's why you're four and zero, or that's why you're three and one, or that's why you're zero and four, or that's why you're one and three. So you think this is on the players and holding themselves accountability, right? How many how many uh, 
tackles or, or blocks the, the, the coach is going to make? Zero. Oh, okay. So, so, okay, then, you know, DeMario Davis, Cam Jordan, they're established leaders on this team. Well, why aren't they speaking up? Or are they? Do they have the attention yeah, of their teammates? That, we, 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 we can't say that they aren't. I mean, we don't, we don't have access to everything that they're doing. I'm pretty sure that they are. But at some point, the attention to detail has to get to all 53 that are, you know, in that locker room. And it's really more than that because you got 16 players also um, on the practice squad. And, you know, you just called up two of them. It, it, it's a multitude of guys, and so it, it, it just can't be those two quote-unquote leaders. Just because they spoke and, 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 and said something, that, that, that doesn't mean that everybody's going to do what they're supposed to do. Of the three losses, is this the most frustrating? This one? Every loss is frustrating. I every, know. Every, every loss is uh, every, every Every time you lose, is frustrating. This is just the most recent. So, I mean, a, a, every loss is, 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 is hurts. Every loss is frustrating. This one hurts because you felt like that you did enough good things.